story and a friend so true Spreading knowledge like morning dew Through the devil verse he roams with glee Unraveling history for you and me Oh devil story and wise and grand Guiding us through time's vast expanse With his words our minds ignite Like everyone else, I found these pictures to be quite shocking and were kind of questioning whether these are real. As you can see, it does say Joey S. Catalano and usually government documents will say their full name, which for Joey would be Joseph Samuel Catalano III. But I decided to dig deeper into this situation and I was shocked to find out what I found. Double story and investigates. I mean, I, I've seen bigger hogs than a little league team, but you know what I'm talking about. So you know. Why are you looking like you, Joey? <laughs> Joey. <laughs> now, am I if that's a fact, am I telling the truth? What? That you looked at little leagues naked? No, that's not what I said. You see, you don't look at all of them. You see bigger teams than little leagues. I never even looked at children. Seen bigger hogs on a little league team. Seen bigger hogs on a little league team. Shocking stuff. We got a confession from Joey C, but not only that, Double Storian was able to find some of the members of this little league team. <sighs> When I was in Little League Baseball, Joey C. kept staring at mine and the other little boy's penises while licking his lips. And another little boy told me that one day Joey C. accosted him and started raping him. It was a wee lot. Joey C. had his way with me. And with all his baseball friends, he used to love having little boys attend their parties. He didn't feed us meth and fed and even make us dance on tables. Based on these accusations, we got our best man, Chris Hansen, to interview Joey C and get his defense. You like to have deep in your throat. I mean, what conclusion am I supposed to draw from this, Andy? Uh, well, you, you, can, you can talk, you can, you, can, you can converse, but it doesn't mean I'm going to do it, right? Unless I do it. Unless you... You catch me on point doing it, of course. So you say I would have to catch you having sex with a 13-year-old girl before you could get in trouble? Before, before you can put me against the law. Yeah. So you're a lawyer? I'm not a lawyer. Oh. Well, you sound pretty familiar with the law. Well, uh, I'm pretty much into academics, so... You're into academics. So what you're saying is for you to be breaking the law, you would have to be caught in the act having sex with a 13-year-old girl? Yes, or let's say... Uh, no. Right, but you'd have to be caught in the act actually having sex with a 13-year-old girl before you could get... Or you have proof that you did it, yeah. Or you have proof that you already did it. Yes. Well, let me correct you a little bit on how the law works. Because it's against the law to try to solicit sex from somebody who's underage on the internet. I didn't know that. I, I had no clue. I mean, come on. Joey C. began friending Chris Hansen after the camera stopped recording. Chris Hansen handled a little man and punched him in the face. Joey C, not able to handle any physical violence because he's a coward, ran away like a little bitch. Thank you for tuning in to Dabble Story and News. Tune in to Dola's Dishonorable Discharge, coming January. Arrivederci. Dabble Story News, oh you're quite the star. Your videos are great, that's who you are. Informative and funny, you always bring joy. Teaching us history with such great deploy. Dabble Story While we laugh and applaud The latest video was truly divine Thank you for sharing, you are quite the fine